give those men and women a chance to spend time with their family, right? So now, Positively Jacks, as many of you have gathered uh, with families starting to prepare your Thanksgiving meal, a small army of students at the University of North Florida and other volunteers have spent the last few days packaging meals for senior citizens who can't afford or who are unable to prepare a Thanksgiving feast. Turkey is ready to go in the dish. So Turkey, got stuffing, and lots of gravy. This group of Meals on Wings volunteers are packaging hundreds of meals. Meals that are prepared for local hospital patients, but were not ordered, so they're the extras that can now be donated to local senior citizens instead of being wasted. Apple pie, pumpkin apple bread, a roll, and some cranberry sauce. All the sides you need. A feast that can now feed the hungry. Inflation has made the need even greater for seniors living on a fixed income. The SNAP benefits just aren't going as, as far as they used to because they get a set amount each month and until that a month maybe adjusts based on inflation, they just aren't able to get as much food as they used to be able to get. Which is why Meals on Wings has expanded from serving just 25 seniors to nearly 250. The meals are labeled. <laughs> Packaged and then loaded onto carts to deliver to senior citizens' homes. Health and nutrition students at UNF do most of the work and learn beyond the classroom. Their empathy has increased just with volunteering, their public service motivation. But those soft skills and leadership skills have really, really uh, developed. You know, they learn uh, communication, working with faculty and staff. Meals on wings. Students even deliver the meals. Hi, Ms. Colleen, how are you? Hi. I brought your Thanksgiving goodies. Thanks. Oh, wow, thank you. Uh, Colleen Lightfoot has been receiving meals for the last two months. It's hard. I, I can't get to the store anymore. She can't work anymore, making money tight. What would you do without it? I'd have some cereal. <laughs> Four meals a week from Meals on Wings is critical. Thank you, thank you, thank you. <laughs> you have been a lifesaver. To students, volunteers, and staff at UNF, these meals are their chance to see what their work in the kitchen can mean for the lives of people in their community. I get people call me and tell me they don't have food, and that breaks my heart. So I really think it's important for us all to remember there are people out there struggling thankful there are good people in this world who are here to help. Happy Thanksgiving! Woo you think, you know, for a minute here, you know, everyone, you know, is busy providing for their own family, but in addition to that, all of those, you know, men and women that you see are also doing more to provide for others. It's really incredible. The senior citizens who are eligible for Meals on Wings are identified, by the way, by community partners, predominantly through senior citizen communities in our area. Meals on Wings always needs financial support, volunteers. So to learn more, you can search Meals on Wings at UNF. You can find a link also inside the story posted right now on the homepage of newsforjacks.com. Yeah, there are so many things that we just take for granted. Yeah. And and among them is that, you know, we're, we're going to have a meal. Yeah. And, and for exactly. these people, you and, know. And you know, I mean, you're, you're preparing, you know, Thanksgiving feast for your family. It's expensive. It is. And it takes a lot of work. And for someone like Colleen, who, who has to use a wheelchair to get around, that is just, there are just so many obstacles to making that something that's even attainable. Right. And did you hear what she said? You know, if, if, if Meals for Wings didn't come by, she, she'd have cereal. And, and from somebody who doesn't know math, I think the number you said, it, they used to serve 25. Yeah. Now it's 250. Yeah. That's an increase that's tenfold. It, it's incredible. And, you know, there are a lot of bigger organizations. We love feeding Northeast Florida, for example, these big organizations. But, you know, there are a lot of small organizations like Meals on Wings that, that could use some love as well. So keep that yeah. in mind as you're thinking about doing something during the holidays for, you know, for local organizations. There's some smaller organizations yeah. out there that could really benefit from your help. And, and here's something else for these students. Yeah, they're learning political science yeah. and English. They're learning a lesson in love and compassion and helping others. It's probably one of the most valuable lessons they'll take away from their college experience. Community, helping people in the, yeah. only in, in the community where you're learning. That's a great story. And we've all learned a lesson there as well. <laughs>